everyone. I have the trio of trouble, Rosie, Ranger, and McKelty here with me today to do a final mini review on the products that came in the November Pet Flow Spoiled Rotten box, which is a monthly subscription service for your pet. They do have an option to choose one for your cat or your dog, which I do appreciate since I own both. It is $24.99 a month, and they very kindly contacted me recently and asked if we would like to try one and just see what our honest opinions were on the products included in the box. So far, I am extremely pleased. Highly, highly recommend this box. But the last product included in the November box was an air cleansing solution by Pure Love, and I just wanted to show you quickly how to use this. And it is four fluid ounces, and I did work as a vet tech for quite a while. So if you want a more in-depth how to clean your pet's ears review, or not even a review, just a tutorial, let me know. But I'm just going to show you very quickly how you go about doing so. And it is really important to keep your pet's ears cleaned because you're preventing debris, you're preventing grime, and you can also prevent ear mites and other issues when you keep their ears very clean and you're preventing hearing loss down the road. So it's really important, especially on a flop-eared dog, which is what all three of mine are. But in the past, I've had do dogs where their ears, you know, were pricked. They stood straight up. I've had German Shepherds that got just as bad ear infections as flop ear dogs do. So, you know, also a really good product to use on any type of ear. So this is the Sweet Pea and Vanilla Scent. Let's see if my camera will cooperate and zoom today. It might not. Well, I'll just read the label for you. It is supposed to cleanse, dry, deodorize, acidify, and it also contains aloe to keep their ear canals a little bit moisturized so they don't dry out. So what you're going to do, and what I like to do is apply it not to a cotton ball, but to a cotton pad. I actually prefer the larger oval ones. I'm just out today so I need to get more. So you're going to apply a generous amount to a cotton pad. I'll just show you right here. And let's see. I think there's a secure thing on the top of it. So I'm just going to show you. In theory, this is how you use this. So you're going to apply some to this oval. And you want to do two because you want to do one for each ear. One just flew off into the floor, and you might need more than one if their ears are pretty dirty. So then what you're going to do is squirt a little bit of this product. You're going to hold their ear back. It's kind of hard to film with one hand. And you're just going to squirt a little bit to the inside of their ear canal very carefully. And then you're going to very gently massage their ear to break up any debris and dirt and see, they don't really care. They're just kind of used to it. And so then, after you've loosened up any dirt or debris in there, you're going to take your pad that has the solution on it and just wipe it out. And you're going to very gently, come here, McKelsey, sit. You're going to very gently just wipe from the inside out, careful not to go into their eardrum or their ear canal. And you're just going to cleanse that whole area. So that is how you use that product. Say bye, McKelsey. Say thank you for watching our little review today. So we'll see you in.